Good evening. Hello, good evening. How are you? The microphone, Karen. <laughs> hello, hello. How are you? Hello. <laughs> good evening to everyone. How are you? Oh, <laughs> great. Blue. Yes, very good. Okay. Let's begin. We are going to have first the attendance. Vamos a pasar asistencia primero, ya ustedes saben. Y luego, pues, continuamos con la práctica que nos quedamos ayer. Solo cuéntenme si pudieron acceder a la plataforma sin ningún problema. Todo está muy bien para ustedes en la plataforma. ¿Pudieron hacer la tarea? Todo bien. ¿Todo bien? Sí, para todos. Sí. Vi que les Gracias. preguntaron en el grupo y no, nadie no, no, no. reportó. Sí, todo bien, ¿verdad? Yes. Ok. No, I have a problem. Oh, you have a problem. ¿Qué le pasó a usted? Cuénteme. Yes. No, no podía entrar en la plataforma. Y no pudo. Pero les expliqué a ellos y me ayudaron. Me ayudaron, pero me lo han mandado al correo. Ajá. Pero eh, si yo me salgo y vuelvo a entrar, no me da acceso. Ah. Solo puedo entrar mediante el correo que me enviaron. Ya le comprendo. Uh -huh. y, a, y al entrar, sí pudo trabajar en la plataforma. No se escucha. Bueno, ¿Aló? ¿Uno? ¿Uno, dos, tres probando? ¿Será que me escucha? Sí. Sí, ok. Sí. Al entrar, sí pudo trabajar en la plataforma. Sí, ayer hice la tarea eh, sin ningún Ajá. problema. Okay. Ahora no pude entrar. Ok, vaya, voy a reportar. Entiendo que ya le están ayudando, pero voy a estar atenta de que le sí, terminen. Yo, de... yo lo reporté, cabal, okay. desde que yo pueda entrar desde internet directo con la clave a la plataforma, porque así no puedo entrar. ¿Cómo no? Solo vi el correo que me enviaron, así sí puedo entrar. Le comprendo. Bueno, voy a estar atenta que, pues que hasta que esto esté solvente. ¿Verdad? Con mucho gusto para que usted no tenga ese inconveniente y muchas okay. gracias por haberlo reportado. Muchas gracias. Ok. ¿Alguien más tuvo algún inconveniente para que lo empecemos, a, para que lo solventemos pues a la brevedad posible? Eh, nos dejan saber, por favor, para que pues ya no tengan ustedes ese inconveniente. Ok. Muy bien. Voy a estar atenta de todas maneras, ¿verdad? Estamos aquí a la orden. Vamos a ver. Eh, Abiel Salomón. Yes, Thank you. Celia Cristina. Ok. Eh, Claudia María. Not yet. Ok. Eh, Concepción Marina. Yes, present. Present. Thank you. Diego Nicolás. Present. Vamos a ver. Eh, Giovanni. Present. Thank you. Iris Cristela. Present teacher, Diego Oriana. Yes, thank you, Diego. Okay. Iris Cristela, no yet. Iris Liliana. No, no yet. Irma Stephanie. Present. Yes, you are here. Thank you very much. Jocelyn Selene. Okay. Eh, Josué Alejandro. Present. Thank you. Juan Ramón Escalante. No. Karen Leticia. Present. Ok, thank you. Eh, Carla Sofía. Present. Thank you. Marcela María. No yet. Marina Yancy. Ok, Mirna Lisset. Present. Thank you. Norma Patricia. Ok, Rodolfo Antonio. No yet. Saraí Guadalupe. Yes. 
present teacher. Thank you. Okay, let me see. Teacher, good evening, present. Hello. Soto. So good evening, so Celia. Nice. Welcome. <laughs> Welcome. I, I, I drive. Um, you are driving. Thank you very much. Okay, aquí uh -huh. ya, le, ya le coloque presente. Thank you very much. Okay, welcome. And let's begin. Let's begin. Yesterday we were practicing with the simple present. You remember that? And we were having some activities. Vamos a ver. Eh, we were talking about different duties. Estábamos hablando de diferentes actividades en el trabajo. Simple present means routines, repetitive activities. Eh, Concepción Marina, can you please give me one sentence? One example. One example de, yes, de, de las que de hicimos class. ayer. Mm -hmm. um, activities that you do I check my emails okay very day. good yes you check your emails every day very good Karen can you please give me one thank you very much Rodolfo <laughs> welcome okay Karen okay, okay. Uh, I check reports Okay, you check reports. Very good. Mirna Lise, your sentence. I, I am read legal I, document. Okay, you, you read legal documents. Very good. You read legal documents. Very good. Carla Sofia? Could you please? I <laughs> Uh, <clears throat> check the WhatsApp. <laughs> okay, you check WhatsApp. Very good. That's very important. Very good. Yes. Celia, can you please give us an example? Thank you, Norma. Organize fields. Okay, you organize. Yes, you organize meetings, you say? Fields uh, activities. Oh, okay. You organize files. Very good. Very good. It is Liliana. Files. Yes. Thank you very much. It is Liliana. Can you please? I... One example. A an activity that you do every day. I answer the phone. I send emails, I visit clients, I call clients. Give me one. Check email. Okay, I check emails. Very good. Muy bien. Vamos a seguir entonces. Con este tema estábamos practicando ayer. Vamos a seguir practicando. Ayer nos quedamos, ayer no pudimos cubrir las páginas que teníamos asignadas porque tuvimos que hacer la presentación al inicio del módulo y eso tomó algo de tiempo. Y antes que pasemos a la, um, pues a la práctica, necesito comentarles algo. Es el hecho que, así como a ustedes, el INSAFOR les audita los minutos de conexión, a nosotros facilitadores también nos audita que los videos estén eh, grabados en la totalidad del tiempo que tiene que ser. El día de ayer yo tuve un problema técnico. Sí cubrimos la clase completa. Ustedes saben que llegamos hasta las 10 de la noche pero la última parte no se me grabó. Entonces, el día de, tuve, tuvimos que reportarlo este día al INSAFOR y a pesar que, nos, pues que la clase se dio, no quedó grabado completo. Entonces, el día de hoy tenemos que extender un poco el tiempo de la clase para que sumen los tiempos. De manera que la clase de hoy, eh, pues vamos a estar hasta las 10.30 porque fue media hora la que no se grabó. Vamos a estar hasta las 10.30. ¿Verdad? Para que, pues, los que se puedan quedar conmigo después de las 10, pues se queden y continuamos practicando, ¿verdad? Es la, es la idea. Y después hacemos la tarea. Entonces, pero les explico que es por tema de auditoría del INSAFOR, ¿verdad? Que, que es que se va a proceder de esa manera. Ok. Y eso sí, minutos les cuenta. Mande. sobre eso. Dígame. Disculpa que la interrumpa. Dígame. Este, pero 
nos afectaría según los minutos, porque como se cuentan, va, los minutos que uno conectado. Sí, los minutos que tiene, que tiene el día de ayer a ustedes no les afecta porque el reporte generó los minutos de las dos horas. Y eso es así, ¿verdad? Eh, el día de hoy, pues los minutos estarían ahí también, ¿verdad? Entonces eso de alguna manera, pues, les podría beneficiar, ¿verdad? Entonces, eh, no es que lo de ayer no le va a contar a ustedes, porque ustedes estuvieron, bueno, estuvimos conectados hasta la hora que era, solamente es el tema del video. Así es que los minutos que tienen que tener ustedes son hasta las 10 de la noche de ahora. Las personas que se quieran quedar conmigo hasta las 10.30, seguimos practicando, ¿verdad? Seguimos practicando es la idea y pues va a quedar en el video. Es el mismo video, no vamos a interrumpir, vamos a seguir de corrido. Ok, tenía que explicárselos, ¿verdad? La razón por la cual vamos a extender la sesión de este día. Ok, vamos entonces. Eh, we have our manual here. And yes, today we were practicing. We finished page 10. Here. Let me see. We finished with the last exercise, this part. And now we're going to continue, page 11. And we have here the first activity, which is a discussion. What activities do secretaries do in your company? Yesterday, we were talking about my activities. I check emails, I um, answer phone calls, I visit clients, but today, we are going to talk about secretaries. We are going to talk about she. Why? Because we are going to practice um, how to change the verbs in that kind of sentences. She sends emails. The secretary writes reports. You remember the difference. ¿Se acuerdan de la diferencia? Cuando lo conjugo con I, el verbo va en forma simple. Cuando lo conjugo con una tercera persona, para el caso ella, cambiamos el verbo, agregamos la S y pues de esa manera lo expresamos. So today we are going to begin by practicing what activities do secretaries do in your company. En cada grupo lo que les voy a pedir es que lo discutan y que hagan una listita de actividades, pero las oraciones van a ir utilizando el pronombre she para que podamos ir modificando los verbos. Y luego regresamos a la conversación. Are we clear? ¿Estamos claros con lo que vamos a hacer? Yes. 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 Ok, very good. Let me send you the invitation. And we are going to practice today here. Very good. We have here the groups. Giovanni. Hola. Solo un dispositivo. No, estoy con dos. dos. Ok, ok. Sí. Ok. Vamos acá entonces. Ok, y ahí a, ustedes aprovechan y se presentan y se conocen porque vamos a estar juntos en todo el módulo, ok? Y tenemos pues caritas nuevas en todo el grupo. Okay, I sent you the invitation. Please click on join. Please click on join. Very good. Thank you. Very good. Okay, Rodolfo, me confirma si recibe la invitación. Hello. Hello. 
Hello, Celia. Sorry, I I changed my phone a uh, laptop. Oh, great. Very ya good. Llegué ya llegó a la casa. Qué alegría. <laughs> okay, le envió la invitación ahorita. Uy, ahí se incorpora. Gracias. Algo. Thank you very much. Okay. Mm -hmm. I will send you the invitation again. Okay, here you are. Dice, entre las facturas. Las facturas. Ajá. Es lo mismo, ¿verdad? Creo yo que sí. Sí, es lo eh, Quiero ver, aquí ya tenemos dos, tres, cuatro, cinco. Uh -huh. Veamos, pongamos este... Prepara presentaciones, que sería... Me imagino. Entonces, ahorita, según entendí, el teacher íbamos a trabajar en la página 11, entonces, ¿verdad? Eh, dice, what does Dominic do? Y ahí ajá. responde Matt, well, she is a secretary, y ahí va explicando la conversación. Pero vamos en el ejercicio 1. Ah, algo así. Vamos en el ejercicio 1. Ah, perdón. No, está bien, Rodolfo. What activities? Ah, ok. Sí, es que ya entre tarde, ya no, no alcancé no, a ent bien. entender bien todo. Sí, está bien. 
What activities do secretaries do in your company? Ah, okay. <clears throat> uh, for example, uh, teacher says uh, the secretary sends uh, emails. Yes. yes, very good. Uh -huh. <clears throat> she Ella uh, agenda reuniones. She, mm -hmm. she arrange an agenda. Arranges an agenda or organizes an agenda. Very good. Organize. Remember letter S. Organizes, arranges. It's third person. An agenda. Yes. Or the agenda, if you want. She goes to the bank. Okay. She goes to the bank. She goes mm -hmm. to the bank. Mm -hmm. Or Organize. 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 Or, organizes. Organize. Okay. Organizes. Organizes. Yes. Five. Five. Good. Nice. También este. También. Five invoice. Invoices. Yes. Pays invoices. Pays. Con S. Pays. Yes. Ah, pays invoices. Pays. Yes. Pays invoices. Vale, tenemos una, dos, tres, cuatro, cinco, seis. Siete. Mm, that's good. Okay. She writes reports. She checks emails. Yes. Sends emails. She saves report and emails too. Yes, good. She schedules agenda. She schedules agenda. Organizes. She schedules agenda. Yes, she schedules, okay. con ese, schedules agendas. Schedules. Yes. Schedules yes. Agenda. She organizes. She organizes. Very good. Fire. Okay. She organizes. Organizes. Me cuesta. <laughs> organizes. Let's repeat. Organizes. Organizes. Very good. Organize. Very good. Organizes. Yes. Organizes. Organize. Okay. So we're ready. She files. Uh -huh. Reports. She files reports. Good. Yes. Ready. Estamos listos. Yes. Ok, yes. Yes. very good. Me los llevo al aula principal entonces. Let's go. Okay. Bye, niñas. Bye. <laughs>
good. She checks. She sends email. Okay. She organizes file. Organizes. Organizes. Okay. She organizes file. She yes. uh, organizes a schedule. Okay. Organizes or she schedules meetings schedule. or. Mm -hmm. Okay. Um, she types email. She types. Okay. She types, types emails and writes reports. Very good. Okay, Giovanni, what do you have in your group? Me escucha. Yes. Eh, tenemos she types important documents. Okay, important documents. Eh, she eh, files invoices. Okay. Uh, she organizes files. Uh, she quotes production materials. Good. He, she sends document. Beautiful. Yes, very good. Thank you very much. Sarai, what do you have in your group? Sarai Guadalupe. Sarai, are you there? Okay. Alguien del grupo de Sarai, me ayuda, por favor. Hi, teacher. Hello, uh, Rodolfo. Yes, thank you very much. Okay, go ahead. Uh, my group uh, is uh, Diego, uh, Sarai, and Josué. Okay. Uh, our, our examples are uh, in the companies Diego. Uh, the secretary is in Diego's companies. The secretary calls the clients. Okay, the secretary <clears throat> calls the clients. Another example is in my company. The secretary makes uh, the invoices. Okay. And in another example, Diego says. Uh, uh, in his companies, uh, the secretary sends emails to the okay. clients. Very good, very good. Thank you very much. That's it, Rodolfo. Thanks. Yes, great. Yes. Very Please. good. Okay, Carla Sofia, what do you have in your group? Hi. Uh, we make two activities for for with the partners okay very good eh, bueno <clears throat> pusimos she, she checks email she answers call phone calls she answers phone calls good. she attend call, phone calls perdón. yes that's okay este she attends the clients or yes. customers Okay, she assists clients or customers. Very good. Uh, she organizes meetings every Very week. Good. Very good. She files documents. Nice. She writes report about meetings. Okay. Uh, she arrange agenda and agenda. A arranges agendas. Okay. Yes, and agenda. <laughs> okay, very she good. She goes to the bank. Okay. She makes copies. Okay. And sometimes she makes coffee. Oh, very important. Very good. She Thank makes you very much. Yeah. <laughs> okay, very good. Cuando usted mencionaba de que she attends clients, yo se lo cambié a she assists clients. Cuando usted usa attend, aquí está en el chat, es cuando usted asiste a una reunión. Entonces usted dice, she attends a meeting. Y cuando usted quiere expresar que ella le ayuda o apoya o asiste a un cliente, entonces usted utiliza assist. She assists eh, Customers, you say, right? She assists customers. Eh, es bien fácil que nos confundamos porque en español tendemos a asociarlo con español. 
pero aquí hacemos la aclaración, ¿ok? Attend a meeting, assist a client. Ok. Are we okay so far? Yes? Okay, let's continue then. We are going to continue in this moment with the, um, the conversation, the one that we have in our manual. And we are on page 11, exercise two. Listen and read the conversation. And then we are going to practice. Let's see. We have here a, conver a conversation between Sonia and Matt. And then we have, Sonia says, let's go over vocabulary first. Sonia says, what does Dominic do? Well, she is a secretary. Oh, I see. What does she do every day exactly? Oh, I see your point. Well, she types reports and sends emails every day. She is a hardworking woman. Absolutely. Does she arrive early? Yeah, she's the first person to arrive in the office. Ok, ¿estamos bien acá? Veamos vocabulario, ¿tenemos alguna palabra? Eh, is there a word that is not familiar to you? ¿Tenemos duda con alguna palabra de esta conversación? Teacher. Yes. How uh, we? Uh, what is hard working? Oh, hard working is a person like you that work very hard, that work a lot. Yes. Okay, that's yes, hard work. Yes. Okay. Thanks. Uh, oh, I see. What does she do every day exactly? Oh, I see your point. Well, she types reports and sends emails every day. She is a hard working woman. Absolutely. Absolutely means for sure. Yes, I agree. Definitely. That's absolutely. Does she arrive okay. early? Does she get to work early? Okay, the class, our class is at 8 p.m. You come early when you come here at, at 8 or a few minutes before eight. So you are early. You see? Does she arrive early? <clears throat> yeah. She is the first person to get to the office, to arrive in the office. ¿Estamos bien con esta última parte? ¿Estamos bien con el vocabulario? Yes. yes? Uh, I remember, I, I remember uh, one sentence is, We have in, the, in my office. Uh huh. We 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 are hard working or doing in the working. Oh my goodness. <laughs> okay, <laughs> but you are hard working. <laughs> yes. Okay. Another, another another co-workers doing in the work. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> okay. Okay. Let's let's practice pronunciation. <clears throat> I will read the first part and please repeat. We are going to do this two times or twice, and then okay. we are going to the breakout rooms for you to practice. Okay, Sonia yeah. says, what does Dominic do? Please repeat. What does Dominic do? What does Dominic do? Yeah, everybody. Okay. What, does what does Dominic do? What does, what Dominic, does Dominic, Dominic, Dominic do? do? Okay. <laughs> Well, she's a secretary. Well, well she's, she's a, a secretary. secretary. Very good. Oh, I see. What does she do every day exactly? Oh, oh I, I see. see. What, what does, does she, she do every day? day? Exactly. Exactly. Very good. Esta oración tiene una riqueza de pronunciación y de entonación, porque usted ve en varios puntos, eh, varios signos de puntuación. And you have to be uh -huh. expressive, ¿verdad? Entonces vamos, oh, I see. Es como, ah, sí, ya entiendo. Oh, I see. Y ahora empieza la pregunta. What does she do every day exactly? Y termina con exactamente. Exactly. Oh, I see. What does she do every day exactly? Please repeat. What does she do every day exactly? What does she do every day exactly? Oh, I see. What does she do every day exactly? Oh, I see. What does she do every day exactly? Please repeat. 
Oh, oh, I see. Oh, I see your point. Let's repeat. Oh, I see, I see your point. point. Well, she types reports and sends emails every day. Let's repeat. She's a hard working woman. She, she is, is a, a hard working woman. woman. Very good. Woman. She's a hard working woman. woman. She is a hard working woman. She's a hard working woman. Okay. Woman. I need you to pay attention here. A hard working woman. Hard working is a characteristic. And a characteristic mm -hmm. is an adjective. Eso lo vimos en el módulo anterior. Ok. Entonces decíamos en el módulo anterior. Black pen. La característica, black. The adjective. And the adjective goes at the beginning. Black pen. Red hard. Hard working woman. Ahí para que vayamos explicando la, la, la forma de organizar las palabras. A hard working woman. Let's continue. Absolutely. Does she arrive early? Please. Absolutely. 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 Arrive Arrive early. 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 Yes. The first part, you are like, certainly. Absolutely. And the second part, Absolutely. it's a question. Does she arrive early? Let's do it. Absolutely. 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 Yeah, right, early. Very good. Early. Yeah. Very good. And the last part. Yeah, she is the first person to arrive in the office. Please repeat. Yeah. 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 She's she the first person to arrive in the office. Very good. Very good. Okay, let's do it the last time and then we move to the breakout room so you can practice. What okay. does Dominic do? Okay. What does Dominique what Dominic do? Dominic do? Dominic do? Well, well, she's a secretary. Well, well she's, she's a secretary. Oh, I see. What does she do every day exactly? Oh, oh I see. I see. What does she do every day exactly? Every day exactly. Y vamos exactly. con el bloque completo, respetando las pausas. Oh, I see your point. Well, she types reports and sends emails every day. She's a hardworking woman. Please do it. Oh, oh you your Okay. Absolutely. Does she arrive early? Absolutely. Absolutely. She arrives early. early. Yeah, she's the first person to arrive in the office. Yeah, yeah. 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 she's the yeah. first person to arrive in the office. Very good. Okay. Office. Very good. Antes de irnos a practicar, what is the opposite of early? Uh, late. The opposite? Yes, late. 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 Very good. Late. late. That's late. the opposite. Aquí estamos recordando vocabulario porque ustedes están en principiante 2, pero realmente ustedes conocen mucho más de lo que estamos usando. Entonces tenemos que despertarlo porque está por ahí dormidito. Ok. Another word eh, to say types report. Another expression to, to say the same. Types reports. A similar right one? Report. Right reports. Very good. Right. Right, right. 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 Report. right. Yes. right. Yes. right. means right. elaborate, right? right. Very good. Okay. Um, makes. The first makes reports. Yes, very good. Okay, person, to arrive in the office, give me a synonym. Mm. To get. Get yes, it. to get, very good. To get home, to get to the office, very good, very good. Okay, very good. So let's go, let's practice. We are on page 11, right? And I'll send you to the breakout rooms so you can practice. Vamos a ver, vamos a enviarles la invitación. 
And I need you to practice many, many, many times. Be expressive. You need to practice intonation and pronunciation. All right, okay. I sent you the invitations. Please click on join. Claudia Maria, welcome. <laughs> okay. No me aparece el link, teacher. Hi. I'm sorry? No me aparece el link. A ver, vamos a ver, vamos a ver, vamos a ver. Josué Alejandro? Sí, correcto. Yo se la envío nuevamente, con mucho gusto. Acá. Ok, gracias. Ok. Hopefully, does she arrive early? Yeah, she is in this person to arrive in the office. To arrive in the office. To arrive in the office. In the office. To arrive. Uh, ahora con Karen. Okay. Okay. Si gusta usted inicia. Micrófono, Karen. No quiere activar. Está apagado. Sí, es que no, no, me, deja, Ay, sí. no me deja verlo. Bueno, vamos a ver si sosteniéndolo aquí. Ok. What does Dominic do? Well, she is secretary. Oh, I see. What does she do every day exactly? Oh, I see your point. Well, she types reports and sends emails every day. She is a hardworking woman. Absolutely. Absolutely. Does she, absolutely. Yes. Does she arrive early? Does she arrive early? Does she arrive early? Good. Yeah, she okay. is the first person to arrive in the office. Very good, super nice. Okay, sigan, sigan, sigan. Yo me voy. Ahora con Ariel y soy Sonia. I'm Sonia, again. Volvemos también. Mm -hmm. What does Dominic do? Well, she's a secretary. Oh, I see. What does she do every day exactly? Oh, I see your point. Well, she she types reports and send emails every day. And sends. She's a hard sends. woman. I'm sorry, Rodolfo. Sorry? Sends. Sends. La um, S suena. Mm -hmm. Okay, thanks. Oh, I see your point. Well, she types reports and sends email every day. She is a hardworking woman. Absolutely. Does she arrive early? Yeah, she's the first person to arrive in the office. Nice. Okay. okay. Again? Again? Yes, yes. What does Dominic do? 
Well, exactly. Oh, I see your point. Well, she likes she calls and sends sends emails every day. She is a hardworking absolutely. Woman. That's she right, early. Yeah, she is the first person to arrive in the office. Okay. Bye. Mirna Continua con mío. <laughs> ¿Cuál había hecho antes? Sonia. Yo, Sonia. Ah, pues le doy. Doy. Bye. Bien. Yo soy Matt. What does Tommy do? Well, she is a secretary. Oh, I see. What does she do every day? Exactly. Oh, I see your point. Well, she type report and say email every day. She is a hardworking Absolutely. woman. Absolutely. Does she arrive early? Yeah, she is a first person to arrive in the office. She's the first person. Very good. Super nice. Ustedes estuvieron juntas en el grupo anterior. En el módulo anterior. Sí. Yes. Ah, ok. Yes. Ya, ya se conocían entonces, ¿verdad? Solo a Jocelyn. Yo solo la conocía. Oh, ok. Muy bien. Sí, mm -hmm. sí. Ok, bueno, muy bien. Espero que se sientan bien en, aquí en el, en el nuevo grupo, porque realmente creo que ya aquí ya vemos de varios grupos, ¿verdad? Entonces, sí, espero que se sientan bien. Ok. Let's continue. Let's continue. Ok. Ahora. Ok, si quieres. Ok. Ajá, tú, Sonia y Omar. Empezamos. Uh -huh. Ok. Sonia va a ser Estefan. No te eh, como sea. Okay. What does Dominic do? Well, oh, gee, she is secretary. What does she do every day exactly? Oh, see your point. Well, she type report and set up a mail every day. She is working woman. Absolutely. Those does she arrive early? Yeah, she is first person to write an office. To arrive in the office. Very good. No se les olvide que cuando pronunciamos el verbo en tercera persona, el sonido right. de la letra S suena. Ok. She types and sends. Ok. Hay que tener okay. ese cuidado. Es lo único. A ver, Normita, ¿con quién lo va a hacer usted? Ok. Eh, ¿Con quién lo hago? Sonia. Eh, ¿Quién va a hacer conmigo? Stephanie. Ok. Ok. What does Dominic do? Well, she is a secretary. Oh, I see what does she do every day exactly. Oh, see your boy. Well, she takes report and said in May every day. She and her working woman. Absolutely. That she right early. Yeah, yeah. Yes, yeah, 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 <laughs> yeah, she is the first person to arrive in the office. Very good, super nice. Richard, yo tengo una duda. Este, Con gusto, dígame. Me ayuda ante la penúltima donde dice Sonia. Yes, absolutely. Does she arrive early? Absolutely. 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 Quiere decir. Absolutely. Ciertamente. Sí, definitivamente. Absolutely. Absolutely. Does, she, does, she, does she arrive early? Does she arrive early? Yes. Ok. Very good. Vámonos entonces. Nos vamos ya a la hora. Okay. Me lo llevo, me lo llevo. Let's go. Beautiful practice. Beautiful practice, the one that you have. Okay, let's see. Vamos a ver, antes que continuemos, quiero ver. Eh, 
Concepción Marina me ayuda con Mirna Lisset. Can you please? Let's do the, the conversation okay. here. Mm -hmm. What does Dominic do? Well, she is a secretary. Oh, I see. What does she do every day exactly? Oh, I see you pond. Well, she take report and send email every oh. day. She, she types... is a hardworking woman. Okay, Mirna, she types. Absolutely. Does she arrive early? Yeah, she is a fair person to arrive in the office. Okay, very good. Mirna said types. Can you please types? Read? Types. Sends. La, la, la letra S suena. Types. Send. Types. Send. Sends. Beautiful. Yes, very good. Karen, can you please um, role play the conversation with Carla Sofia? Okay. What does Dominic do? Well, she is a secretary. Oh, I see. What does she do every day exactly? Oh, I see your point. Well, she types rep reports and sends emails every day. She is a hardworking woman. Beautiful. Yeah. Absolutely. Does she arrive early? Yeah, she is the first person to arrive in the office. Nice, very good, thank you. Okay, Claudia, Mar Claudia Maria and Giovanni, could you please? Okay. Uh, I start. Okay. What does Dominic do? Well, she is a secretary. Oh, I see. What does she do every day exactly? Oh, I see your point. Well, she types reports and sends emails every day. She is a hardworking woman. Absolutely. Does she arrive early? Yeah, she is the first person to arrive in the office. Beautiful, very good. Marcela Maria, could you please role play with Celia? What does Zomini do? Well, she's a secretary. Oh, I see. What does she do every day exactly? Oh, I see your point. Well, she takes reports and sends email every day. She's a are working woman. Absolutely. Does she arrive early? Yeah, she is the first person to arrive in the office. Beautiful. Thank you very much. Rodolfo and Josue Alejandro, could you please? Hi, Josue. Josue Alejandro, are you there? Okay, Rodolfo and Diego Nicolás, please. Okay. And I think Diego is not here. Okay, okay, and okay. Josué Alejandro is driving. Okay, then Rodolfo and Jocelyn. What does Dominic do? Well, she is a secretary. Oh, I see. What does she do every day exactly? Oh, I see your point. Well, she, ty she types reports and sends email every day. She is a hardworking woman. Absolutely. Does she arrive early? Yeah, she is the first person to arrive in the office. Very good. Jocelyn, does she arrive early? Could you please? Change to change. No, no, no. Okay. Does she arrive early, Jocelyn? Does she arrive early? Early, early. Early. Yes, beautiful. Thank you very much. Okay. And let's see before we continue, Stephanie, 
Could you please role play with Iris Liliana? Thank you very much. Okay. What does Dominic do? Well, she's a secretary. Oh, see. What does she do every day exactly? Oh, I see your point. Well, she takes report and send emails every day. She's a working woman. Do, does she arrive early? Arrive? Yeah, she, yeah, she is the first person to arrive in the office. Very good, very good. Norma and Aviel, and then we move. Okay. The um, way, what does Dominic do? Aviel, the microphone. Excuse me. Okay, go ahead. <laughs> what does Dominic do? Okay, where she is a secretary? Oh, I say what do she do every day exactly? Oh, I see your point where she type report and send emails every every day. She is a hard working woman. So look at that she arrived early. Yeah, she is the first person to arrive in the office. Very good. Okay, very good. Super nice. Very good. Okay, let's continue here. We are on page 11. And here we have exercise three. You are going to help me in this moment. Select the correct form of the verbs to complete the sentences. Number one, she, and then we have type or types. Report. Types. Types. Very types. good. Type. Types. Types. Yes. Third person. She types. And remember, you types. need to make that sound. Types. You need to make types. that sound. She types reports. Very good. Type. Number two, we have a question. Do she does or does she? she? Does, does she? she? Yes. Does Beautiful. She? Yes. Does, does she? she? And look at the verb. All right. Right. Yes, in this Let case, she arrive. we don't have S because we have the auxiliary, no. remember? Does she arrive yes. late? Very good. Right. Number three, does she? Arrive. 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 Es el mismo caso de acá arriba, ¿verdad? Does she arrive? Does she arrive early? Okay. Did you circle? Teacher. Yes. Le falta la asistencia. It's nine. Thank you very much. Yes. Okay. Emocionada escuchándolos estaba. Okay. Thank you, Karen. Muy bien. Vamos entonces a la segunda asistencia de la noche. Rapidísimo. Y luego continuamos. Ok, Abiel Salomón. Thank you, Karen. Present. Thank you. Eh, Celia Present. Cristina. Present. Thank you. Claudia María. Present. Thank you. Concepción Marina. Present. Thank you. Diego Nicolás. Present. Thank you, Diego. Eh, Giovanni. Present, teacher. Thank you. Iris Cristela. Not yet. Okay, Iris Liliana. Present. Yes, you are here. Thank you very much. Irma Stephanie. Present. Thank you. Jocelyn Selene. Present. Thank you, Jocelyn. Josue Alejandro. Oh, yes, you are here. Yeah. Juan Ramón Escalante. Not yet. Karen Leticia. Present. Thank you. Carla Sofía. Present. Thank you. Marcela María. Present. Thank you. Marina Yancy. 
not yet. Okay. Mirna Lisset. Present. Thank you. Norma Patricia. Present. Thank you. Rodolfo. Present. Thank you. And Saray Guadalupe. Present. Thank you very much. Okay, let's continue. Vámonos rapidísimo a continuar con nuestra práctica. Estamos acá. Vamos a ver. Okay, we are here. That, that was page 11. Let's move on. Let's go to page 12. Here you have the difference. ¿Se acuerdan que lo mencionamos al inicio? Estábamos entonces en las oraciones. He, Dominic, which is a she, or it. Then we go with checks, goes, likes. And then they, or my co-workers, which is plural, or the employees, which is plural, we only use check, go, like, no es. That's the way we conjugate the verbs. Are we okay here? Are we okay so far? Yes, right? Yes. Okay, very good. So this is the order in the sentences. But this is for you to remember the order that we have in the questions. So we begin with the auxiliary. Does or do. You use does when you are using he, she, and you use do when you are using we, you, they. He, she son pronombres, sustituyen nombres. Pero si usted está usando, por ejemplo, acá veamos Ricardo Arjona, then you say, does Ricardo Arjona check reports? Si usted está usando acá Shakira, Does Shakira check reports? Ok. Es como, eh, es el equivalente. Aquí estamos representando una mujer. Ocupamos esta estructura. Un hombre representamos, ocupamos esta estructura. Ok. Entonces vamos con el orden. Does he check? No llevamos la S en el verbo. ¿Por qué? Habíamos explicado que el auxiliar es el que se ve afectado aquí con la letra S. Ya no la necesitamos dos veces. Does he check reports? Y luego, do, do we check reports? Do you check reports? Do they check reports? Y estamos acá. Ok, ¿estamos bien hasta acá? Yes. Esto es un recordatorio. Esto ya lo saben ustedes. Are we okay? Ok, vamos entonces. Vamos a aplicar estas estructuras en el ejercicio 4. Acá tenemos varias, eh, varios verbos, action words. And what I need you to do is to identify where to place them, to fill in the blanks here. And then you go with call, have, check, wake up, work, and go. But go is three times. Go, go, go. You have three blanks for go here. Entonces van a identificar en dónde es que se ubica cada verbo y cómo va la conjugación de acuerdo al resto del párrafo. ¿Are we okay? ¿Estamos bien con las instrucciones? Yes. ¿Tenemos alguna, alguna consulta o algún significado de estos verbos que tengamos un poco de duda? Con mucho gusto. ¿No? Ok. Let's go then. Vámonos. Estamos en la página 12. That's page 12. Exercise 4. Y luego venimos y vamos a eh, verificar en conjunto. Ok. I send you the invitations. Please click on join. Same groups. Thank you. Very good.
persona trabaja y con eso. Okay. Entonces sería Claudia works with Dominic. Okay. Claudia trabaja con Dominic. Bueno, creamos, creamos que así es. <ríe> ¿Qué haría así, ve? En Claudia, work with Dominic. They go to have lunch together. At 4 p.m., Dominic goes home. We finish. Finish. Okay. <laughs> yes. Okay. We are going back to the to the main classroom, all right? Okay. okay. They have to go lunch together. At 4 p.m., Dominic goes home. Okay. Y en, y en eh, she go, eh, no sería también el she go is to work. ¿Cómo está sí. hablando de ella? Ajá, tercera uh -huh. persona. Llévala, uh -huh. es she go. She go to work. To work. Es correct, teacher? Yeah, she goes to work. Yes. She goes, ok. Oh, to work. And she gets there. That's page 11, right? Is she checks. Okay. Holes all good. I don't know. Holes on the title, in the title list. Okay. Are we done? Si hemos terminado? Yes. 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 Okay, very good. Let's go back and we are going to check. Oh my God. Here we go. Okay, very good. Let's check. Let's see what we have here. Now you help me, please. Yes. Ok, eh, vamos a ir una oración cada uno para que tengamos todos oportunidad de practicar. Ok, cuando ven un punto, usted se detiene. Celia, you begin. From Monday to Friday, Dominic wake up at 5 p.m. Ok. Stephanie, continue. She go to work and um, where she had there. Again, please. She. She go. She goes. To work. She goes. Uh, West, right. Goes. Perdón. Yeah. She goes to work. Yes. She goes to work and um, when she had there. When she gets there, vamos a pausar ahí. Vamos a ver, continuamos por favor. Giovanni. Uh, she gets there, se quedó, ¿verdad? Yes. Eh, sería she shake, check her email. Ok, she, and, okay, wait, wait. She checks, okay, remember? Uh, she checks okay. her okay. email Him, and her. calls. Ok, and calls all the clients, all right? All the clients. Uh, in here daily list. Very good. Okay, vamos a pausar ahí. Vamos a ver. Uh, please, let me see. Claudia Maria, could you please continue? Lisa and Claudia 
work with Dominic. Works, remember? Oh, no, I'm sorry. I'm, I'm really sorry. Lisa and Claudia, that's plural. I'm sorry. Yes, work with Dominic. Yes, very good. And then we continue here. Uh, Mirna Lisette, could you please? The microphone, yes. They have to launch they together. Aquí tenemos dos verbos. They, they have to go. Al revés. Vamos con they. They, they go to launch. They go. They have. They go to have lunch together. Okay. They go to have lunch together. Okay, Karen Leticia, could you please? Karen? Hola, hola. Me yes. escucha? Yes. Okay. Okay. At 4 p.m. Dominic goes home. At 4 p.m. Dominic goes home. Very good. Okay. Mm -hmm. Estamos bien todos? Are we okay here? Yes? Okay. Okay. Yes. Very good. Muy bien. Ahora mire, vamos a hacer algo. El manual, vamos a ver. En primer lugar, esta clase es para, es como nuestro laboratorio, donde practicamos, nos equivocamos, corregimos, aprendemos. Para cuando usamos el idioma inglés ya en el día a día, Ya tenemos la práctica y lo hacemos con mucha seguridad y mucha eh, pues precisión. Lo mismo pasa con el manual. Eh, el manual nos da situaciones en las cuales podemos practicar, pero tenemos que irlo trasladando al, a, la, a la realidad nuestra. De manera que vamos a ir ahora a los breakout rooms. Les voy a dar unos minutos para que ustedes redacten un párrafo similar. Escojan una secretaria de una de las compañías de su grupo Y van a describir las actividades verdaderas que esta secretaria utiliza. Aquí ya Dominic ya, ya pasó de moda, ¿verdad? Ahorita era para que practicáramos, pero ahorita ustedes lo van a hacer ya en la vida real. Cuando regresemos, ya ustedes nos van a contar de las actividades que la secretaria que han escogido pues, hace en el día a día. ¿Ok? ¿Estamos bien okay aquí? ¿Sí? ¿Yes? Y van a incorporar otras actividades, no solamente las que tenemos acá. Un párrafo bien lindo van a preparar, I know. Ok. Ready? Yes. Please click on join. I'll send you the invitation. Please click on join. Very good. Yes, very good. Okay, Jocelyn, Sarai, very good. Sarai, please. Sarai recibió la invitación. Me, me comenta, por favor. Si no, yo se la envío con gusto de nuevo. Se le envío de nuevo. Se la envío de nuevo por si no la ha recibido aún.
Right. A organiza su agenda. She organizes her agenda. Sí. She organizes. Organizes. Is agenda. Her agenda. Organizes. Organizes. Sí. Yeah. Organizes her agenda. Her agenda. Very good. Okay. ¿Le leemos lo que hemos escrito? Sí. Ok, ahorita no. From Monday to Saturday. Eh, Marita she drivers to work every day. Repítame eso, por favor. From Mondays to Fridays. Marita she drives. Ok, si usa Maritza, no usa she. Es uno de los dos. Ah, ah okay. 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 ok. Perdón. No, that's fine. Maritza drives, así sería. ¿va? Maritza drives, 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 good. Se oiga la S, drives, yes. to go, pero, ajá, to work. Yes. Ella va al trabajo, ¿verdad? Yes. She start work eight o no. Ok. She start sí. work at eight. At, ah, ¿cómo se dice? At. At eight. At a-a-m. Yes. Yeah, she assists. Ajá, ajá. She as no, Marit Maritza assists her boss um on organize his agenda. Very good. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. Hasta ahí nos hemos quedado. Hasta Beautiful. Ahí. Okay, continue, continue. Beautiful. Okay. Very good. Very good. Thank you. Okay, okay. continue, please. Va, entonces aquí ponemos también. Types write, legal document. Write legal document. Types of rights. Rights. Describir. Describir. Rights. Rights. Right. 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 document. And About what? Mm. The report. About what? <laughs> <laughs> No, hay escrituras. Ya le trabajo en el programa, ¿eh? No, para nada. ¿Cómo vamos? ¿Ay? ¿Finish? Eh, oh, ok, 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 good. Continue, please. Uh, what time does she leave the office? Are we ready? Ya lo tiene. Sí, ya, te, ya lo tenemos. Quiero oírlo, quiero oírlo. Okay. Quiero oírlo. Elizabeth is a secretary. She receives visitors and reports. Okay, she receives. Your attention. Receives. Receives visitors and reports for your Attention. For my attention? Ajá. Uh -huh. For my attention? Para su atención, sí. Para la mía? Para la atención de ellos. You. For they, your attention. They, 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 they. Have, yes. Their attention. Ok. Their attention. Their attention. Their. Obsessive, remember? Okay. Their attention. Yes, but, permítame. Abiel. Abiel. Sí, sí. No sé. Sí. Nos ayuda, por favor, con el sonido del entorno. Ahorita. Thank you, thank you. Thank you very much. Ok. Ok. Che. Vamos checks. con their, ¿verdad? Aquí estamos en el uh -huh. chat. Their. Okay. Sí. Good. Ok. Can you please? Ok. Um, possessive checks emails okay organizer organize file, files organizes files yes. very good 
writes reports. Yes. And answers calls. And answers phone calls. Very good. It's phone calls. Phone okay. calls. Yes. To be more specific. Me comí el teléfono. <laughs> ok. Ya, ya es la hora, tí, ya, ya es la hora. Del hambre. Ya tengo ratos que entro y nada de que están hablando de comida como la vez anterior. <laughs> oh, sí, es que no hace falta el incitador. Sí. sí. Ok. <laughs> ok. Eh, ¿Estamos ahí con el párrafo? Yes. Sí, yo, yo solo esas correcciones, dos correcciones de, yes. de en lugar de your day okay. y agregar phone. Very okay. good, muy bien. Vamos a ver, entonces eh, escojan quién lo va a decir y ya en un par de minutitos me lo llevo. Practíquenlo con la lectura y en un okay. par de minutitos nos vamos. Ay. Ok, gracias. Ok, thanks to you. Very good. Seven, seven o'clock to nine o'clock helps to the accountant to organize reports. And she makes invoice to the clients and she assists, assists to the clients. She assists the clients. Yes, she assists to the client. Uh -huh. Ah, the client. Uh -huh. Exactly, okay. yes. The clients. Uh, she organizes the manager agenda. She organizes? <clears throat> organizes the manager agenda. Yes. Uh, she argues with argues. the client. Argues. Argues. Thank you. argues with the client and co-workers. <laughs> en serio. She yes. argues. <laughs> oh Real. my goodness. Real. Real. <laughs> en la realidad. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> Good to know. <laughs> okay, continue. <laughs> and and Abigail lives in the office at 6:45 okay. a.m. Okay. Ah, uh, ella llega o ella se va? Llega. Okay, she no. arrives. Arrives. Yes, uh -huh. lives es que ella se va. She arrives. Ah, okay. Arrives. Okay. And she starts to two seven a.m. Okay, she starts at seven a.m. And she starts seven a.m. At, at at seven a.m. Okay. Very good. Muy bien. Va, escojan quién lo va a decir y practiquenlo por favor. Ya casi me lo llevo hoy. Okay. 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 Very good. Or go home. She goes. For she goes. She goes home. She goes home. Very good. Mm -hmm. She goes home. She takes a bus for goes to home. No, no, no. Then she takes a bus. For going, when, for going, going home. Eh, no había for escuchado going. el takes. Yo creí que era el, el verbo principal. She takes, se puede, bus, she takes a bus for, when she goes home. Yes, when she goes home. home. Very good. You have the two options. Beautiful. Yes. She takes a bus. No sé por qué. Cualquiera de las dos. She takes a bus for going home. Yeah, good. For going home. Going home. Are, are you ready? Yes. Are you ready? Yes. Okay. Yes. Okay. No, escojan, escojan quién lo va a decir y practíquenlo una vez más y ya casi me lo llevo hoy. Okay. Okay. Aquí estoy solo que me está descargando la com. Comparemos. She makes bank transfers. She has the transfer, verdad? Yes. She, okay. She makes bank 
transfer. Yes. Okay. Or you can say, ese, está bien lo que, lo que han puesto, está bien. Solo le doy una segunda opción. She transfers money. Ah. Es, y that is another option. Usted coja la que mejor le gusta. Okay. Es otra opción. She transfers money. Uh -huh. Quiere decir lo mismo, ¿verdad? Sí. Exactamente lo mismo. Okay. Voy a escribir la otra por aquí. Okay. Okay. She transfers money. She transfers, no se le olvide la S, money. Good. Okay. Agregamos otras más, aparte de las que hace un momento. Um, she reads a report. Sí. She has break at 10 a.m. A.m. Very good. Sí. She distribute reports in the port in the department. Nice. Um, no sé si va a continuar Norma o para que participemos ambos. Yes. Okay. She call the supply. She calls. She call the supply. The suppliers. Very good. Suppliers. Suppliers, in plural, right? Ah, okay, suppliers. 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 She transfer money? Yeah, she oh. transfers money. Transfer. Transfers, con ese, transfers. Transfer. Okay. Que se escuche la S, ¿cierto? Yes, please. <laughs> Hasta ahí hemos hecho hasta Muy el bien, muy bien. Bueno, me lo voy a llevar ya al aula para que, para que cada grupo presente su, su párrafo, ¿ok? Ok. Ok. See you in a minute. Very good, very good. We are ready. Super nice practice. There you go, very good. Here is your like. Very good. Ok, vamos a empezar entonces. Vamos a compartir los, los párrafos que han, que han redactado de secretarias de la vida real. Acciones de la vida real. Ok, vamos a ver. El grupo de Iris Liliana. ¿Quién nos va a compartir el, el párrafo? Iris Liliana, el grupo de Iris Liliana. Giovanni. Ok, Giovanni. <ríe> Ahorita eh, sería Elizabeth is a secretary. She okay. receives visitors receives. and re visits. Receives visitors. Receives visitors yes. and reports for their attention, checks, emails, uh, organizes. Uh, Organize, files organizes organizes files writes report and answer phone calls beautiful very good super nice very good claudia maría el grupo de claudia maría quién nos va a compartir acerca de, de su secretaria democráticamente yes. el hombre del grupo oh my goodness <laughs> okay yes. rodolfo right Ok, bye. Ok, Rodolfo, go ahead. One, two, three, go. <laughs> the, uh, the secretary's name is Abigail. Okay. Abigail arrives in the office at 6.45 a.m. And she, sta she starts at 7 a.m. Ok. Uh, Abigail from 7 to 9 a.m. helps to the accountant to organize reports. Okay. And she makes invoice to the clients and she assists the clients to, uh, she organizes the manager agenda. Organizes? Organizes the manager agenda. And during the day she argues With the clients and co-workers. Oh my goodness, argues. <laughs> Are we okay with argues? Estamos claros con argues? Yes? <laughs> no? Argue, argue is when someone has a discussion with you. 
It's like, this is my <laughs> argument. And the other person, no, this is the argument. No, this is the argument. So she argues with customers, you say, and with coworkers. Yes. <laughs> okay. Oh my goodness. Okay, continue. And, and she leaves the office at 5 p.m. Okay, she leaves the office at 5 p.m. Yes. Nice, very good. It, that's for real, right? Yes, real, Oh real. my God. <laughs> Completely. <laughs> okay, good. <laughs> okay, thank you very much. Um, Marcela Maria, who's going to say your paragraph? Hi. <laughs> okay, great, great, very good. I like that. <laughs> okay, go ahead, one, two, three, go. I'm going to talk about Mirna. Okay. She's a secretary. Okay. Mirna get up at Mirna? 6 a.m. Mirna gets up. <laughs> Mirna get up at gets, gets, gets yes. up. Mirna gets up at 6 a.m. She goes to work at 7 and a half a.m. And when, then when she gets there, turn on the computer. She check email, answer phone calls, and assist the customer. Messenger WhatsApp, write document, send document for email. She files document. She go to have lunch at uh, 12 in a half p.m. and finish at 5 p.m. and she take a bus for going home. She takes a bus for going home. Very busy, right? Super she nice. She's a hardly... <laughs> a hard working secretary. Hard... Secret. Oh, very good, very good. Nice, very good. I like that. Okay, uh, Norma. Who is going to say the paragraph? Who's going to talk about the secretary? Norma? ¿Quién lo va a decir del grupo de Norma? Uh, okay. Okay. Very good, Stephanie. Go ahead. Okay. One, two, three, go. From Monday to Saturday, Marixa. Uh, Marixa drives, drives to work. Uh, Marisa start work at 18 a.m. At 8 a.m., okay. She assists her boss and organize his agenda. She reads and report. Right, each, reports, right. Right, report, uh -huh. She has break at 10 a.m. And she distributes reports in department and she calls the superior superior and she she transfer money she transfers money transfer money very money. good okay very okay. good okay that's it yes let's yes great very good applause for you that was great great exercise mm -hmm. thank you very much okay bye a meeting Antes de que pasemos a, a la siguiente práctica, voy a pasar la última asistencia para ya no interrumpirlos, ¿ok? Vamos a ver, eh, Abiel Salomón. Present. Thank you. Celia Cristina. Present. Thank you. Claudia María. Present. Thank you. Concepción Marina. Present. Thank you. Diego Nicolás. Ok. Giovanni, Herbert Giovanni. Present. Thank you. Iris Cristela. No, not today. Ok. Iris Liliana. Yes. Present. Thank you. Eh, Irma Stephanie. Present. Thank you very much. Jocelyn Selene. Present. Thank you. Eh, Josué Alejandro. Present. Thank you very much. Juan Ramón not here. Okay, Karen Leticia. Yes, you are here. Present. Thank you.
Carla Sofía. Present. Thank you. Marcela María. Present. Thank you very much. Marina Jansi. Not today. Mirna Lisset. Present. Thank you. Norma Patricia. Present. Thank you. Rodolfo. Rodolfo Antonio. Present. Thank you, Rodolfo. Saraí Guadalupe. Ok, very good. Muy bien, señores, vamos a continuar. Les recuerdo que este día vamos a estar trabajando hasta las 10.30 para los que se puedan quedar acompañándonos. Ahora vamos a estar haciendo eh, más prácticas de lo que hemos, como hemos estado trabajando en este momento. Vamos a avanzar. Estamos acá. Here, very good. Muy bien. Let's move on. Let's go to page 13. Página 13. Y mire, en la página 13 vamos a encontrar time expressions. Remember that when we use the present simple, that means routines, habits, habitual activities, repetitive activities. So we are going to use the time expressions in order to express the frequency of the activities. Every day, cada día, every day, every week. Todas las semanas, every month, todos los meses, every year, todos los años, once a year, una vez al año, twice a year, tu, dos veces al año. Ok, y tenemos también eh, daily, que decíamos ayer, diariamente, weekly, semanalmente, monthly, mensualmente. Tenemos entonces estas opciones para poder expresar la frecuencia de las actividades de las cuales estamos hablando. Entonces, vamos a trabajar ahorita en este ejercicio. Mire, write five questions you can ask a classmate about a regular day at his her job and use the questions to interview a classmate. Vamos entonces a hacer aquí la pregunta. Mire, what does he... Por ejemplo, what does he do on Mondays? What does he do every day? What does she, okay, what does she uh, do every month? What does she do weekly? Okay, vamos a ir preguntando acá actividades que se hacen con cierta frecuencia. Vamos a elaborar las preguntas y luego nos las vamos a preguntar pues uh, la vamos a utilizar para preguntar y respondernos en los grupos. Quiero saber si estamos claros con la instrucción, con la indicación de lo que vamos a realizar. Yes. Les recuerdo que en la página anterior teníamos un recordatorio de la pregunta, de la estructura de la pregunta. Allá empezamos con do o con das. Recuerdan que cuando ocupamos a WH word, lo único que hacemos es ponerla al frente. What does she do on Monday morning? Ok, por ejemplo. De esta manera vamos. Ok, vamos entonces. Let's go. Vamos. Ok, I sent you the invitations. Please click on join. Click on join. Very good. Thank you very much. Okay. Celia, ¿me confirma si ha recibido la invitación, por favor? Ok.
Así entendí yo que era. Así comprendí yo que era. Y, y digamos en la siguiente ponemos week. Week. Weekly. Week. O week o weekly. Eh, si estamos ocupa, aquí en la primera. ¿sí? A ver. Ah, ok. Si, aquí tenemos dos opciones. Perdón que los interrumpa. Okay, si usted okay. ocupa en la primera línea, usted dice every week, every month, every year, ¿verdad? O puede ocupar la otra forma, daily, week. La primera forma, every week, es cada semana. Ese es el equivalente. Luego, si usted dice weekly, es semanalmente. Todo lo que termina en LI es mente, semanalmente, mensualmente, diariamente. ¿Ok? Uh -huh. Entonces es o la primera forma o la segunda. Ok. Y en, en ese caso omitimos every. Sí, si usted no, si usted, sí, no podría decir, no lo podría combinar porque sería como un cada diariamente, no, no podríamos combinar. <ríe> Ok, sería Se every day uh -huh, uh -huh. or daily, cualquiera de los dos. Y aquí, ¿verdad que es la, la pregunta era qué hace él o ella? Sí, claro. Por ejemplo, la, esta, what does she, a very quick. What does she do? What does she do? Ah, what does she do? Every week. Very good. A very quick. Mm. Sí, ¿verdad? Y que hubiéramos utilizado el otro sería cuatro. Ok. Sería, what does she do weekly? What does she do weekly? Very good. Very good. Weekly. Así. Yes. Sí. Ok, la otra será month, la otra es un yes. mes, ¿verdad? Yes. Okay. Every month. Every month. Entonces aquí, every week. Every week. Puede ser. What does he do every month? Oh, what does she do monthly, verdad? Yes. Monthly. Aquí no estamos definiendo eh, que, que sea una actividad que hace... No. Día a día, sino que son, simplemente le preguntamos qué hace Las ella frecuencias, o qué hace él. Con esas frecuencias. En la última, ahí tenemos un, se nos, es un typo que tiene, en what, el segundo what. La A ah, está aquí. al final, no, en la, en la de abajo. Justo no, donde tenía el curso. Ah, ahí, ah, ahí. Ah, ah. Sí, sí, sí. Lo, Justo ahí. lo invertí. Yes. There you go, very good. Okay. Yo eh, you never get late. You never get late. No, I, I, I always get late because, <laughs> because I get late. I get up seven and at seven very at seven. Lucky you at 7, 7.30. Ajá. ¿Ya? ¿Ya ves? Ok, Rodolfo, what time do you get up? I get up at 5 in the morning. 5 a.m. Every day. Yes, every day, every week. Ok. Y escuchó <laughs> la encarnación, ¿verdad? Yes, every day. <laughs> and, and Claudia, what about you? I get up at 5.30. 5.30, okay. 
Oh my goodness. Okay. Yeah. So imagine seven. Good. <laughs> <laughs> Okay, did fight you finish fight it? Yeah, okay. <laughs> did, you finish. did you finish with the questions? Yes? Yes. Okay, good, good. Yes. Ya casi me lo llevo. Oye, vamos a ver acá. ¿Cuál sería la pregunta? Uh -huh. Eso lo hacemos bien en cosas que todos los días lo hacen. Ajá. Use your imagination. <laughs> um. Semanalmente, write tal report. vez. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. Write report. Concepción, digamos. Okay. What does Concepción write report? Así. No, what does Concepción no. do every do. Friday or every week? Uh -huh. And the answer, write report. She writes reports. In the question, you only mention the frequency. You are using every day or every week or daily or yearly or monthly. And in the answer, then you mention the activity. O sea, aquí estamos al revés. Ahí <laughs> hemos puesto. Ajá, a ver. What time Marcela get up every day? Ah, pero eso está muy bien, porque usted está preguntando what time. Ya saben. Está preguntando uh -huh. la hora, ahí estamos bien. Pero cuando usted pregunta what, uh -huh. no va a poner la actividad en la pregunta porque esa es la respuesta. Pero cuando dice what time, sí, porque es, es la hora la que usted pregunta. What time does Marcela? And then you continue. Ok, la otra que hemos puesto es... What does Charla, Carla have meeting? Ah, okay. What does Carla have meeting? Esa no está bien. No, no, no. What does Carla do every, every week? She has a meeting every ah, week. Ah, es la que teníamos al revés. Ajá. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. Sí. Habíamos, lo que pasa es que habíamos What incorporado la respuesta en la pregunta. Uh -huh. Sería entonces, what does... Carla, Carla do, do, do every day. Every day or weekly every or, day or every week. the time expression, yes. Well, that's Carla uh -huh. do monthly, uh digamos. -huh. Ajá. Okay. Monthly. Sería she has meetings. She has meetings or she has a meeting. Very good. What do you do? 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 What do you do? Es, what do eh, you do? Muy bien. Ajá. Es la persona, digamos, no, no es primera persona. En la tercera persona sí ya vamos a usar el A. Pero para preguntarle no le puedo usar eso. Uh -huh. Tendría que decir, what do you do? ¿Qué tú haces, digamos? In the morning, or oh, no, what do you do in the weekly, on the weekly, for the Sirango, sí, what do you do in the, how is it, this word, weekly is the, weekly, weekly is semanalmente, semanalmente, todas las que, a ver, permítame, voy a encender la cámara, todas las que terminan en L-I, LI mm -hmm. es el equivalente a mente. Entonces, daily, diariamente. Diario. Weekly, semanalmente. Monthly, mensualmente. Y las que tiene arriba, que van con every day, cada día. Every Ajá. week, cada semana. Ok, entonces, entonces, el verdad que la pregunta sería, 
por decir algo, what do you do eh, on the weekly? Sería okay. que haces. What do you do weekly? What no, do you... on. <coughs> no. Sería what on the weekend do... en el fin de semana, pero aquí solo habla de la frecuencia. What do you do uh, weekly? ¿Qué hace usted semanalmente? Semanalmente. Uh -huh. yes. No tendría que ir la... La, esa la preposición, no. Uh -huh. La preposición. Ok. What do you do weekly? Yes. What do you do... Uh -huh. eh, eh, every day. Every day. What do Monday. you do? Yes, every Monday. Very good. Every Friday. Every Saturday, very good. Y luego Entonces, la respuesta. Ella me responde, ¿verdad? Ajá. Este, pero cuando, digamos, si yo tengo que contar lo que ella hace, entonces yo digo, she does. She, o, I, o de un solo da la actividad. She writes reports. She mm. transfers money. She answers. Ya no usa el das como verbo. Ya no lo puedo. Ah, usar. Okay. Ajá. Va con la, con la actividad. Very good, very good. Okay. Um, vaya, hoy sí entendimos. <risa> <Ya. risa> Andamos bastante perdidas. No, muy bien, muy bien. Ah, <risa> Entonces, este, le pregunto y usted me contesta. Ok. Bien. Entonces iríamos así, ¿verdad? Anotando las mismas, haríamos cinco, ¿verdad? Uh -huh. Está okay. Lidia aquí en el teléfono, le estoy copiando. Ah, ok. No, se, se confunde uno, si no. Sí, sí, porque. Yo siento que sí me está costando bastante. No, si a mí también, a mí me cuesta bastante. Yo digo, pues, chica, hay varios que van bien adelante. Es que como hay quienes ya han estudiado su poquito. Sí, pero cuando, vamos a aprender. Cabal, cuando no, no ha estudiado. Va, entonces la pregunta, digamos, la uno, pregunta uno sería, what, what, what do you do? What do you do? Y le ponemos aquí, digamos, sería monthly. Sería mensualmente, ¿verdad? Ok. Monthly. Usted me va a responder. ¿Qué okay. hace mensualmente? A pay the bill, 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 ¿cómo se dice? ¿Piles? ¿Cómo? A los recibos. Yes. Pues, puede contestar. Mm -hmm. A pay the bill, bills. Bills, uh, yes. Ajá, uh, a... Um, Digamos, ¿qué otra cosa puede hacer al mes? Eh, ¿Cosas que hagan el mes? Cerrar con cerrar parciales. Ah, vaya. Entonces. Finalizo la... parciales. O ¿Cómo puedo decir? I'm finished. I'm finished. ¿Cómo se dice examen? I'm finished. Parcial. No sé si exams, exams exam. or, eval, or evaluations, yes. Ah, okay. Entonces usted podría decir un finish evaluation. Finish evaluation. Un finish evaluation. Y la otra podría ser a pay, a pay, bill. Bueno, otra pregunta sería what, what do you do daily? Ajá. Ay, yo le puedo contestar al cook todos los días cocino y lavarte ay todos los días trabajo I work ah, sí tiene razón I work, I cook, I clean, I, <laughs> when I shower, I make, make up, make shower. Daily. Entonces la respuesta sería, I 
work. I cook. I work. I clean. Clean the oven. Okay. And I attend the meeting. <laughs> Todos los días, todos los días. Okay. Nos vamos al aula. Oye, me lo llevo. Ok. Ok, okay very good. Did you finish? Yes. Did you finish? Yes. 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 Ok, nice, very good. Nice practice. You were like asking and answering questions and using the vocabulary and using the structures. Very good. Ok, vámonos a la última actividad de esta noche. Les agradezco que se han quedado conmigo y vamos a seguir practicando porque para eso nos hemos quedado, ¿verdad? Vamos a ver acá entonces la última actividad. Nos vamos a mover. Hemos estado en la página 13. La página 14 la vamos a dejar en pausa un momento. Les aclaro para que no crean que se nos ha olvidado, sino que esta está programada de acuerdo pues a la carta didáctica que nos han autorizado en el INSAFOR para otro día de esta semana. En este momento nos movemos a la página 15. Y acá vamos a estar, hemos estado hablando de Dominic. And then here, read the welcoming letter to Dominic's new job. Mire, Dominic consiguió un nuevo trabajo. Aprendió inglés. Y consiguió un nuevo trabajo. Así es que ahora estamos aquí. Le han dado una carta de bienvenida. Y vamos a ver qué tal le va a ir a Dominic. Entonces estamos acá. Travers Inc. Right? For a better future. Dear employee. Welcome to Travers Inc. Congratulations. You are now part of the Travers family. Here is some information about your new job. Please read it carefully. Name, Glenda Dominic Sanchez. Job title, Junior Sales Manager. Mm, nice. Key job duties. Re remember duties, right? Key job duties. Have a meeting with your manager every week. Get in contact with customers. Answer clients' questions about our products. Take orders on the telephone. Call potential clients. And then benefits. Vacations two weeks per year plus public holidays. Nice. That sounds interesting. And then the salary, it's $440 per month plus bonus. Good luck, Mark Travers and his debt chair, right? Ok. ¿Dónde aplicamos? <laughs> ok. <laughs> Sounds good, right? Sounds good. <laughs> Muy bien. ¿Estamos bien con el vocabulario de esta carta? ¿Hay alguna palabrita por ahí que quieren que aclaremos antes de ir a discutir la carta? Yes, Norma. Excuse me, CD. ¿Qué por cómo se dice? Keep, key job duties. Acá, ¿verdad? No, arriba, donde dice please read it. Ah, muy bien. Please read it carefully. 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 Cuidadosamente. Carefully. Por favor, léala cuidadosamente. Gracias. Ok. Carefully. Yes. How many duties is activities? Okay, two, four, five. Five duties. Yes, duties, activities that are obligation at work. Comparábamos acá, mire, yo le comento con gusto. Aquí en el chat le pongo, chores son las actividades que sí o sí las tenemos que hacer en la casa. Por ejemplo, do the laundry, eh, wash the dishes, right? Eh, sweep, mop, clean, dust, son obligaciones en la casa. Duties, 
son las actividades que sí o sí hacemos en el trabajo. Están relacionadas a las, a las actividades en, eh, laborales. Those are duties. Key job duties. Son como obligaciones en el trabajo. Ok. ¿Estamos bien con lo demás? Yes. Ok. Very good. Then what you are going to do in your groups is that you are going to mm, read the letter again, the welcoming letter, and then I need you to discuss and answer questions in exercise. You are going to say if they are true or false. Van a de definir si estas cuatro oraciones son verdaderas o falsas. Si son verdaderas, las dejan tal cual. Solo le ponen verdadero. Si son falsas, corrigen la información. Y, eh, and you get the correct information from the letter. ¿Estamos bien acá? Yes. Yes, ok. Let's go then. Vámonos entonces. Ya el último ejercicio lo dejo ir. Vamos a ver. Let's go to the groups. Very good. Please click on join. Okay, very good. Celia and Diego, please. Muy bien. Diego, me confirma, por favor.
Did you finish? Yes, right? Yes. Okay, very good. Yeah, let's check. Acá estamos, muy bien. Vamos a ver rapidito aquí cómo estamos con estas oraciones. Number one, Dominic speaks to clients in her new job. True or false? ¿Qué me pueden decir? Dominic speaks to clients in her new job. True or false? True. True. True, yes, that's true. 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 Yeah, very good, very good. Let's see, number two. Her salary is 100 per week. False. False, okay. What's the correct information? What's the correct information? Um, his salary Point. is 40. 400? 440? 40. 40. 40. Yes. 40. Per, Dollars? Per month? Dollars. Dollars. Plus bonus. Plus bonus. Very good. Very good. Okay. Number three. Dominic four, gets four, a four, yearly four, vacation. True. True. True, right? Very good. That's true. true. And number four, she has to work on holidays. False. 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 Very good. False. Vacations are? She now has work on public she holidays. Yes, yeah, she, she doesn't she work on off. public holidays. Very good. Okay, super nice. Mire, rapidito Chair. terminamos el ejercicio. Teacher, dígame. Yes. Uh, one more question. Uh, is she hasn't or no. she doesn't? She, she doesn't. doesn't. She doesn't have to work. Oh, okay. She yeah. doesn't have. She doesn't have to work. Very good. Okay. okay. Yeah. Very good. Bueno, los dejo tranquilitos porque tenemos que hacer la tarea en tres minutitos. ¿Verdad? Thank you very much. I really appreciate. De verdad que aprecio mucho que se hayan quedado con esta práctica. Y Me les gusta. agradezco mucho. And see you tomorrow, all right? Sí, tomorrow. See you tomorrow. 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 Okay. Have tomorrow. a good night. Tomorrow. Good night. Bye bye. Good night. Good night.